Hey, what's going on? It's Scoobid here. So today we're going to be taking a look at Wiggler's latest troll level. It's a 30 second troll speed run, uh, which I fell for. Um, I didn't bother recording my playthrough of the video uh, because I thought it was a 30 second speed run. Uh, we'll soon learn it's anything but. So uh, right away from the start, I just want to ignore the thwomp. He's, he's going to take out that power block. He's going to hit the on off switch, run through here. And then in the next room, I've, I fell for this trial. I fell for lots of these trolls. So, so if you run to the right, that that is going to fall down, and that you kind of instinctively run that way. So you need to kind of jump about and try and t trigger the on-off block twice, and then that will cause that to happen. Uh, then you just need to wait for the uh, the uh, spiny. At this point, hit that, jump over the uh, thump. Now here, you need to do a duck jump. If you don't do a duck jump, you're going to hit that. Uh, that saw blade up there. So now you just need to run to the right, get the key, through the door. There was like a lot of hesitation when I played that the first time. At this point, you know, normally you'll stand still, and that's how you're going to get trolled there, down the pipe. So now here, for once, we're actually going to trust the coal block. In we go, that's going to set off the bomb. Now this part, you can see here, I, I kind of run and miss. You, if you just jump straight up, you're going to hit that block, and you're going to die. Down here again, just hold right. Can hit the on off block. Oh, you, you don't need to hit it twice to kill the um, the piranha plant, but I ended up just doing that because it's quicker, I think. At this point, you need to ignore the first mushroom, come come across the vines, break the block, and there's a hidden coin behind that saw blade, which you see I've just got there. Here, you can actually trust the coal box again, get the mushroom, that's going to cause the piranha to come down, and then you get the sp spiky helmet. Now, down here, you're going to have the urge to run right. That's not the solution. You need to come up here, hit the power block very, very quickly so you avoid that uh, chain swamp. And now through the door. There's the hint for the uh, the coin, but obviously we already know it. So now we're at CP2 already. So at this point, you need to take the, up, the upwards path. Now what you need to do next is get the, um, uh, the Mecha Cooper. That's what they're called, aren't they? Get the Mecha Cooper to blast out the blocks. And at that point, a fish is going to come down, but also the fire flower. So now we can get rid of the uh, the ice blocks there. And at this point, you're just going to take the damage. Ignore the cold box there. That's going to cause a form to smash you in the head. And now, I fell for this a couple of times. You don't want to go up there. You do actually want to go straight down. And now at this point, you just want to go to the right. Eventually, some clouds are going to come down. And now you need to hold back here, because if you run... The fonts as they're falling, they will kill you. And here there's a coal box. So that's going to uh, get the bob on to destroy the blocks. And again, when you come on the ice here, you just want to hold right and run as fast as you can to avoid the chain chomp. And now this part's a bit strange, because when I got here on my first playthrough, I died a few times. And I found, as you'll see, that... So the hint is telling you to hit the coal box. This, you know, so you hit the coal box, you go up. But what I found is, if you don't die and you get straight here, when you go through the door, a um, a bullet bill blaster is going to fall down, and it's going to say that you need to go in the pipe to the right. But I've tried to go in the pipe to the right, and there's absolutely no way to get anything, you know, that pipe to get exposed. So I don't really understand that part. So I found just killing myself, essentially CP2 in myself. Um, going through it all over again, uh, which we'll get to pretty quickly because I fast forwarded the clip. But uh, yeah, it's weird. So then you get back here, and I do everything exactly the same as I did before. You know, I'm going to hit the coal box, reveal the hidden block if I can hit it, go up the vine if I can reach the vine, and then when I go through the door, you're going to see this time. For whatever reason, the bullet bill blaster doesn't fall down. So again, you're going to hit a hidden block, which this time is going to reveal a bob -omb, And that's going to trigger an on-off switch off screen, I assume, that then makes the pir um, the piranha vine, is that what they call it? Just call it a vine, come through. And now we're heading towards the end of the level. There's a hidden red ball blaster behind there. So you've got to kind of wait a second or two, jump, go down the little um, blocks, and there we go. We've got the win. So that was Wiggler's latest level. If you're stuck... You know, hopefully this will help you. Um, hopefully you don't get too stuck because it's quite an easy level. And uh, if you haven't played it, make sure you do because it's an absolutely brilliant level.